Hey guys, Young Man JHS here, back with another tutorial. Today we're going to be talking about how to increase FPS on CSGO. So, first thing first, there's a couple of things you can do in game, and then there's a couple of things you can do in Windows um, so that you can get the most FPS you can. So, first come to video settings. Uh, now, you want to set the resolution to the lowest one you can, and then set all of this to the lowest setting that you can. Uh, yeah, so you basically just want to set this all to disabled or low and then apply. Okay, so the next part is in Windows, so I'll see you over there. Okay, so next thing you want to do is unpark your CPU cores. So you want to click on it click on unpark CPU, run it, and then open it up, click on check status, it'll take a couple of seconds, just for the um, checks for the, the CPU. Um, so for some people it can take longer, for some people it can take less time, I don't know. When I did it, it took about five minutes the first time, but then after it runs a bit quicker. So, um, yep, you just want to wait for that. It shouldn't take that long. Um, but yeah, as I said, it depends on the computer. Um, yep, but while that's happened, um, I'm going to show you another step. So, I'm going to go to services. Oh, actually, we can do this now. And then you want to click unpark all. And uh, mine are already unparked. And then after you unpark all, you have to restart your PC. So after that you want to go to services and you want to scroll down until you find Superfetch. You want to right click on it, properties and disable it. Then you also want to go down to Windows search, properties and disable that. Then um, you want to get something called CC Cleaner, I'll leave a link in the description as well, and run it. And this will basically just clear a bunch of junk files in your um, in your PC that you don't need. Um, you know, don't worry about deleting these, you, you know, it's not nothing important, it's just a bunch of junk files. So as you can see, it didn't delete much because I keep my PC pretty clean, but I've heard people having like 40, 50 gigs of just junk files, which can really slow down your PC. So then you want to go to the search, click run, or what you can also do is click the Windows key and R. Then what you want to do is open uh, percent temp percent, and then just delete whatever you have in here. Do this for all current items. Uh, some of them can't be used because uh, so you have to skip them because they'll be used currently. And then yes, so you delete what you can. You see the ones that are being used currently are literally being created like you know in the last 20 minutes. Um, then the next thing you want to do is uh, empty the recycling bin. No, oh, not undo delete. Redo, delete, and empty the recycling bin. Uh, yep. Just to get rid of the files you just deleted. Uh, then you want to go to Windows, this PC, and the little PC with the the Windows icon. Uh, you want to click on Properties, then go to Disk Cleanup, and select all of these. Now this won't be that big because we've done the last two steps, but again, you know, it's worth doing. And then just click OK. It'll take a couple of seconds. Um, it'll take longer, obviously, if you have more to delete. Then you want to go to Tools, Check, Scan Drive, and this will basically check for any errors in your drive, which can really slow it down. So you really want to do this step. Again, um, depending on your, you know, PC speed and you know how clocked up your drivers. This can take longer. Then you want to go optimize. Um, if you have a solid state drive, there's not really a point in optimizing it. But um, yeah, just optimize any hard disk drives you may have. So 
just click optimize and then that will finish that again it will take longer depending on how much stuff you have in there so then you want to go to control panel type in power click on power options and you want to set this to high performance it'll be to balance uh, by default but yeah, if you set it from high performance then your PC will just use everything that it needs to so then you just want to go to advanced geez I can't spell advanced and click view advanced system settings settings and then you want to click adjust for best performance basically what this will do is it will remove some of the like animations from your operating system um, personally my PC can handle it so I'm going to leave it on but yeah basically just like see uh, animated controls like shadows thumbnails things you don't really need um, and it can really boost your FPS if you adjust for best performance okay and there you go so here we are in a, a copy just to check the FPS as you can see we're sitting around the 300 to 290 mark in, uh, in the pre game uh, you know, tips down to about 280 when we're all just kind of scrambling there um, yeah so I'm just gonna play this round to see what the FPS looks like but it's sitting pretty solid right around uh, 290 it's also worth uh, recording nice you know, in that gunfight, it was around 280. There's no chunk. So, just gonna go to the uh, beat and see if we can get uh, a nice fan of the pick. Anyways, you can see that we're sitting around uh, 280, 290 just to get your skins looking a bit nicer. Anyways, it's been your mind HS. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that sale. bell. Oh.